Hello everyone, welcome to IM Labs. My name is Vishakha Priya. Today we are going to discuss about types of cloud computing based on deployment models. So let's start with a short introduction. Cloud computing provides developers and IT departments with the ability to focus on what matters most and avoid undifferentiated work such as procurement, maintenance and capacity planning. So basically there are three types of cloud computing based on deployment models and each type of deployment method provides us with different levels of control, flexibility and management. Understanding what deployment strategy we can use can help us decide what set of services is right for our needs. So the first one is public cloud. So a cloud based application is fully deployed in the cloud and all parts of the application run in the cloud. Application in the cloud have either been created in the cloud or have been migrated from an existing infrastructure to take advantage of the benefits of cloud computing. So a cloud based application can be built on low level infrastructure pieces or can use high level services that provide abstraction from the management, architecting and scaling requirement of core infrastructure. The second one is hybrid. A hybrid deployment is a way to connect infrastructure and application between cloud based resources and existing resources that are not located in the cloud. The most common method of hybrid deployment is between the cloud and the existing on-premises infrastructure to extend and grow an organization infrastructure into the cloud while connecting cloud resources to internal system. The third one is on-premises. So deploying resources on-premises using virtualization and resource management tools is sometimes called as private cloud. On-premises deployment does not provide many of the benefits of cloud computing but is sometimes sort of for its ability to provide dedicated resources. In most cases, this deployment model is same as legacy IT infrastructure while using application management and virtualization technologies to try and increase the resource utilization. So that's all for today. I hope you like our video and if you like it, then don't forget to like, share and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.